Imagine me almost 30 years ago. I'm still schooling these. You cold on that mic, I do know that. That was shoved in my back, will I die? Is it too late to retaliate? Why couldn't they drag me? Commit to tie my hands up and gag me. Yeah. At, at that time, at that I was time. like, it was, I mean, I was, I'm living it out. If we friends, mm -hmm. this is Jamaica, mm -hmm. I'm devoted and committed to being your friend. Mm -hmm. If we enemies, I'm devoted, devoted and committed, committed to, to being your <laughs> enemy. <laughs> Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Watch it. They see it. <laughs> they, they know see it. I'm going. They, they, they probably run from me. But yeah. so, because I, I know how we as human beings, we think, and, or me, I should say, um, after finding out that you're the only person that they did that to, how did you feel about that? I mean, I had, I had a mission to accomplish. So, I wasn't really, I just knew that it was just, it wasn't. It was always, you know, like, okay, I'm going to do my thing. Everybody just doing their own thing. But it was never like, okay, we blood and we brothers Right, now. so you already knew that in your head. Okay. So really, you didn't believe in what they done, really. And they lucky you didn't do something to them. Well, that's why they went ahead and hid my <laughs> <laughs> But even after that, even after you got that's it back. That's what I'm saying. That's but what he's talking because, about. Because it was like, it was just something like for me. It was just okay. I'm gonna take it. It was that. It was almost like fun. It was almost like it was fun. Wow. What was the conversation like after? Right afterwards, bro. This what I don't, bro. At that time, I was on some whole other. I I ain't met a guy to this day, and not saying it just because it's me. That was as hungry as I was. That I'm. Look at me now. I'm, imagine me almost thirty years ago. I'm still schooling these. You cold on that mic. I do know that. That was shoved in my back. Will I die? Is it too late to retaliate? Why couldn't they drag me? Commit to tie my hands up and gag me. Yeah. At, at that time, at that I was time. like, it was, I mean, I was, I'm living it out. If we friends, mm -hmm. this is Jamaica, mm -hmm. I'm devoted and committed to being your friend. Mm-hmm. If we enemies, I'm devoted and committed, committed to, to being be your enemy. <laughs> Let me ask you this, man. You say one time, one time, I think it was, you, was it Tupac to reach out to you? Came down and mentioned your name and they didn't tell you? Yeah, he, on the radio. And who didn't tell you? Nobody. Nobody. Who knew about it? I was supposed to tell the you. DJs and niggas that listened to the radio. And niggas that knew he was in town asking for Mr. Mike. Before that boy passed away, mm. came to H Town, called DJ Hard Hitter and asked him. Called DJ Hard Hitter and asked him. Tupac, the, he came down here. He hollered, "Hey man, I want to get with Mr. Mike." Man, Harder gonna he could probably gonna tell you, yeah, and uh, cause it was he wasn't the one directly. Somebody called him and told him. Okay. But they didn't get it to me. To, then he the one came and finally told me. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101.